aviation is really a huge economic driver for the state, and it's a $44 billion industry. That's gonna to continue to grow. I think airspace in, a, in maybe, a, maybe a decade, maybe less, uh, is gonna be number one here when it comes to essentially GDP of the state. It's getting there because people are realizing that this is economically a great place to do business. I think Oklahoma and Oklahoma City is very unique, and there are a lot of reasons for this. So first of all, the cost of living is very reasonable here. If you compare it to some of the other aerospace hubs that exist in the United States, and obviously there are several of them, and we've looked at several of them before we made our decision to come to Oklahoma. Although a lot of those areas include the resources that you may need, they don't have the total mix. They don't have the welcoming attitude that Oklahoma has, the commitment to partnering with the business, which certainly we've experienced. There's a lot of big players in aviation in this state. Boeing's one that comes to mind, and they're a great partner, strategic partner. When we evaluate all of our facilities, we look at our high cost areas of doing business and our low cost areas of doing business. And where it makes sense, you move from high to low cost. And the business case closed for Oklahoma. We lead a global business from Oklahoma City. So the other determining factor was the availability of a workforce. We've had no trouble in finding the critical skills that we need here. Northrop Grumman is another strategic partner of us. Northrop Grumman's been here about 25 years. It uh, started officially as the B-2 program got going uh, around 1990. And uh, the Air Force, being a large uh, sustainment uh, center here, they serve their country with our company. And that is an Oklahoma value, an Oklahoma heritage that really uh, comes together in what we do. We had a company recently, Kratos, that came here and they moved from California and they came to Oklahoma. And they were very, very excited about how many people rallied around trying to make sure that they had the resources and the support they need. I think we're the coolest business in the world. These are jet unmanned aircraft that look cool, that sound cool, that are fun to build, that are fun to design and that are really, really important to the community and to the country at large. Our target aircraft are used for our military to test their defensive systems and their offensive systems against what would otherwise be an enemy aircraft. What this really does, I think, for us, and we're very proud of this at Kratos, to actually bring the integration and production of a complete aircraft system that will roll out the door and be produced in Oklahoma. It's really a win for everyone. Most companies, when they're looking for a place that they want to put a business, are looking at a couple of different factors. One is cost, and Oklahoma has a great, great cost structure. The second thing is, and this is something I have not seen anywhere else, is really uh, the total partnership between the state and the local government to try to make sure the businesses are successful. The Department of Commerce and the Chamber of Commerce have been longtime allies of ours uh, for years and years. The biggest thing, and it was a pleasant surprise, is all of the discussions that we had that said, we want you here, we want to support you, we want to help make this easy, we want you to transition in and be a part of the community. It doesn't stop when you sign the lease. Everyone in Oklahoma have said, we want to help make this a success, and they've stayed with us the whole time. The state has done some great things, like a, an engineering tax credit that has really helped to be able to get the right kind of workforce into the aviation industry. People are realizing that there is draw toward this place, that this, the universities are producing great people. Just this summer, we have almost 50 interns at our facility where uh, many of them are from the uh, local universities and they want to stay here too. And as industry grows, we're giving them opportunities to stay here and to make a great living and to live in a place where the rest of the cost of living isn't gonna take so much of their salary and they're still making a great salary right here. If somebody has never been to Oklahoma, the first time you fly them in and they see the airport and they get to see downtown, everything starts to get just a little bit better. Then they look at the housing prices, things get a little better still. With all the redevelopment in Oklahoma City right now, Oklahoma City is definitely the place to be. Everything that you would need to attract the full span of employees from your entry level, very young employees in their 20s up to close to retirement age employees. It has theater, it has sport, it has a little bit of everything for everyone. When people come here and they start interacting with us and they see all the different expertise that's here, they experience the culture and they also start to understand the cost advantages of being in the state, they're very excited. 
So I would just encourage people, take some time, come here to the state, uh, see what it's all about. I think they'll be impressed before they leave.